What's going on, YouTube Nights? It's your boy, the Unfading Rocket here, and it's time for another episode of Rocket Rants. Today we're doing episode 20, and this is going to be a little bit more positive than the videos I've made in the past, because something positive has happened in the gaming community recently. I would probably say maybe two days ago. Sony, you guys know Sony, the people that make PlayStation and the very good games like God of War and Spider-Man, The Last of Us and Uncharted. Yeah, basically, you guys know all about the cross. If you guys aren't really interested in all the cross-platform nonsense that Sony has been saying over the years, well, you can rejoice now because Sony has officially taken the cross-platform thing, beta thing that they were talking about, I want to say last year. They finally got it out of beta and they say now it's available for any developer who wants to implement cross-platform play in their games. This is really good news for several reasons, the primary of which is, is that if you have friends who own an Xbox, well you own a PS4, or they own a PC, or they own a Switch, depending on what kind of game you guys are trying to get, and if it's even available on the Switch, you guys can finally play together. It, you know, it, it's positive for very reasons. Now that means that, you know, we don't have to be set, we don't have to be tied down to buying, you know, multiple consoles at once just to play games with each other. It has really good news. It's you know it's a really positive consumer thing that Sony has done here, and I've you know I'm in full support of it. So congratulations, Sony! You're getting three claps from me. Good job, man. You guys are the MVPs right now of the gaming generation. You guys came in like a golden goose. It literally actually happened yesterday. I want to say I found out about it yesterday, but I think it came out probably uh, two days ago. And it, it was kind of low-key, though, so I wouldn't be surprised if you guys didn't hear about it, unless you guys have heard about it yesterday. But if you guys still don't know anything about it, like, yeah, uh, two days ago, I want to say in an interview, the uh, Sony boss, I want to say his name is Jim Ryan, but I could be wrong about that. But anyways, yeah, in an interview, he said that Sony has taken the cross-platform beta thing out of beta, and now it's available for any devs who want to implement uh, cross-platform play, they can do so. Now, this news, like I said, came out only two days ago, so we can't immediately be expecting developers to say, yo, just, you know, let's put in cross-platform play right now, you know, expecting patches to come in like that. This kind of a thing looks like, uh, it seems like it's probably going to take a couple weeks to get done. And that's, and once again, it's for the bosses who want to get it done. Uh, a, a good example would be, um, if you guys know PUBG, the people of PUBG earlier this morning actually released an update, or at least they made an announcement for an update that was going to allow cross-platform play between PS4, Xbox, and PC. Which is great news, because that finally means that now, if I, if you own PUBG, I don't own PUBG because I'm not going to pay $30 for something that's, what, two years or three years old because it was already on Xbox? But anyways, um, yeah, I'm not going to, but anyways, yeah, um, PUBG is going to allow cross-platform play. I don't know if the update came out or not, but, you know, if you guys own PUBG, then you guys could, you know, be interested in that. For me, personally, I'd like to see it in uh, games like Monster Hunter World, especially, because, you know, with the iPhone beta, with the iPhone beta, now we can finally play with PC and Xbox peeps. Borderlands 3 was a game that was supposed to have it at, you know, that was supposed to have it. Uh, they said that they weren't going to have it at launch, but at this point now, you know, Gearbox... You, you guys don't have any excuses, man. Randy Pitchford, bro, I, I gotta call you out, man. At this point, you guys have to add it in. I don't care if it takes two or three weeks, but you gotta say it's coming because Sony has allowed it now, so you guys have no excuses. Other games like Minecraft, because remember that... Um, Remember last year when they made that trailer and uh, Microsoft and Nintendo made that trailer a play together on Minecraft? Well, now Sony can do the same damn thing. So I would like to see it in Minecraft. I'd like to see it in fighting games, especially like Mortal Kombat 11, Tekken, uh, Dead or Alive, but Dragon Ball Fighter Z definitely, Xenoverse, Naruto, those kind of games. I'd like to see it in fighting games as well. It's overall just a positive thing that's happened to the community right now, and I am all and I am all in full support of it. Now, whether or not this comes in next year, I really don't know. I mean, I'd say, when I say next year, I mean the next generation of consoles. Like I said, I, I don't really know. At this point, since it's already in it, it's already in there, they, they can't take it out. Because if you take it out, people are just going to get pissed again. So, you know, we'll have to wait and see what happens. But all I know is that right now, you can, depending on the game, or, yeah, Ark 2, I would like to see it in Ark. Depending on the game, you can finally play with your friends. And that's really great news. That's kind of all I really had to say because... You know, it, it's it's one of the it's it's a W for Sony because just last week I was about to give them hell for making that terrible. Um, I was about to give them hell for making that terrible state of play because I, because you know the only two games that people were generally interested in, or at least I was interested in, was Last of Us Two and a story trailer for Call of Duty Modern Warfare, and I was about to give them hell for it. But then the you know they they literally 360 it and came out with this great news that kind of was a little bit under the radar. But I'm willing to, you know, I'm willing to look past that because they did something good. So it's like, I'm, you know, right now, Sony, Sony's in good graces now. 
you know, they can only go up from here because if they were to, if they were to take this back now oh they'll lose the console generation without a doubt so sony good job the unfading rocket gives you five stars for that announcement not for your console stuff Anyways, uh, that's about it for the video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to leave a like on the video. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see have cross-platform play sometime in the near future. And as, as always, if you are new to the channel, so please, you know, make sure you subscribe if you really enjoyed the video. You know, because I'm going to be posting more videos at least once a week. And I'm also, you know, thanks to the people who came in by the stream yesterday. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be streaming tonight, but, you know, we'll have to wait and see. But anyways, I'm rambling here. I'd like to see, I mean, I'd like to see you guys hopefully next time in another video. I've been the Unfitting Rocket. Peace.